Welcome back to NASCAR Fort Gear Racing, and today we're going to be doing something a little bit smaller as Richmond Raceway, as we're going to be doing something is almost likely for smaller as Martinsville Raceway. Now, before it's going to be the Speedway or Richmond Raceway, now, before this isn't going to be going to be at first, the final race is going to be going on to Phoenix Raceway and Arizona as well, so we're done here for two tracks. And let's get right here to New Hampshire. Now, even though it's going to be going for Rovile 400, which is the road course, and because the weather is finally overcast and about for this race. This track is absolutely pretty long, and because it's going to be almost literally smaller as possible. So let's just spawn your cars as we're going to be using for it's the number eight car the number seven car is absolutely going to be using for about for this thing so perhaps let's just try to do something kind of a luxury now let's just try to do what is going to be the 20 laps as well even using like despite seeing this the 17 car is absolutely the blue one the 16 car was absolutely that i already drive about this thing so Let's choose number 15. Skip Barber is going to be using, I just tried to use. But I'm currently in the next part at Martinsville. But probably the number 13 car is out of the race, but probably. Now, let's just going to be using the number 6 car, the new man version. Now, probably using the number 49 is what actually that I already driven for this car that were not gonna be so such as using like this the number 48 is alex bowman now probably using the number 52 vehicle is the aerodynamics of the number 62 now let's probably use this car no 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 i didn't really need like to do like this one so this is the number 66 we already did here for about for many more recently like we're gonna be doing so the Solar 66 is absolutely pretty such as going to be using custom cars and whatever. I'm probably using the number 23 GSS and probably using the JPW as we're going to be doing for the Lion's Cave. Now, before we're going to be racing throughout for 20 laps, let's begin for our acceleration and here we go. If the lap times doesn't going to be count, that raises over a hundred miles an hour we doesn't matter that is a hundred kilometers or studs per second which is extremely slow without the road course and because of the weather is overcast such as well now let's just gonna be taking a very slower reference as well without any losing connection before that doesn't gonna be matters how it gets worse now let's just gonna be looking at ourselves for a first couple of laps we're doing this for today if the lap time counts we're gonna be making for something very serious is gonna be going happen this is absolutely started to get really serious in almost 20 laps and during lap times now lap times is gonna be going on to their way and without touching the yellow lines without causing penalties and perhaps this is gonna be a little bit easy or almost too easy as well unfortunately this is actually saying that is a little bit easy which means it's gonna be taking for about for many more time and about for the sponsors as well Jeremy and I are currently using a Mustang but probably this is whenever this has got to be the slower things as just going on Going slower than 20 laps is going to be taking for about for under 60 seconds. It will be taking for over 40 seconds in about the lap time. So the next lap is we're going to be making and about to do like this thing. And before we're going to be taking on to the Martinsville and then Richmond Motor Speedway without further it taking and about for these things as well. So the Richmond Raceway is using for a part of the classic races and about for these retro things as possible so it is about the smaller like these things that the last career win for Jeff Gordon now looks like we're going to be taking about for this first three wins now we're going to be taking without for the lap number four and because this name over here was actually unknown because 
all over the this one the number 26 vehicle without the number 13 so where is the number 13 car because it's not literally right now it's absolutely been gone for too long and perhaps in real life so because I'm not very sure this isn't gonna be going to do like this not this anymore for just saying for this out loud it's just gonna be keep on on many laps to go because even before it's not going to be talking about for this one because it's lap number 5. Now it took for a very much more time and about for many more laps to go. And this isn't going to be very easy. Now it is going to be very hard to take around for this 20 laps. Perhaps it's going to be going for a 15 lap race. And it's slow. Not suitable to go for around for 200 miles an hour. It's almost 198 miles. 98 miles away from this thing so it's gonna be very far close before in lap number eight that doesn't really matter this feels so slow in about for this race because if i'm just gonna be moving around for this thing and because perhaps if i'm just gonna be going back into the pits but looks like in recently laps later that wasn't gonna be in the case now 103 miles per hour just like i just increasing the speed even because this isn't going to be going to as well and but like I say this is absolutely for the last year by year 2020 that reduces the amount for this some kind of glass the glass spoiler was absolutely just ruined itself we're just going to be going for regulations since 2019 ruined this for its very first time and that should become boring as well and because look at these things as well before pandemic and because like I never going to be saying for about for this one so this is the lap number 8, and this is where the final lap it goes on to the Forza Motorsport 7 that I just, that I don't like or like to see this about this. And I'm pretty not sure that we're going to be continuing NASCAR and about for this thing. And because we're just going to be still going to be going for so on. And because this is actually the slowest lap time, not almost there for about for this one. But perhaps the slowest lap time is in North July Bay, but not in this speedway. This is the New Hampshire Speedway in about the last lap in lap number 9. So I cannot believe this isn't going to be going on for about for this situation. So in about for a slow matter of lap times and a fewer results in about for this thing. So maybe in 20 laps in about for this thing that I just went here to survive. But I cannot believe this isn't going to be going on for this one. So if in Martinsville, this is actually the slowest, whatever it is. Not in Bristol, I never felt. Now we're in lap number 10, that was isn't going to be going to very much quick. And now we're going to be the only last more laps to go before we're going to be end of this video. And literally, immediately fast. Here comes four more laps to go. Now this is the last one we're just going to be trying to do for its last 5 laps to go. Even it's absolutely going to be, I thought this is going to be took around for just very more times as well. If the laps is continuing for a total lapse of 14, which is the final lap of this race. And I'm probably we're going to be very sure we're just continue to speed it off with this cell. And because it's not really like the fastest, like more of these things. And how does the... NASCAR rev is almost like this perfect and because I'm probably to start accelerating up for this moment until I just reach to up to the volume to level 5 and I cannot believe this isn't going to be very quick as well so in, in lap number 12 it is the last 4 laps we get around here and because of this is going to be going to under 15 minutes of this video it's going to be taking for very much time and why we are taking here for a very such a long time. So because of this more likely lapse around here in NASCAR, fourth gear racing, and about for the lap times, even over a hundred videos of NASCAR lap times. Even this is gonna be very too much, and it's gonna be a lot of them. But more like it's gonna be this. And like I say, it is gonna be the lap 13. By the end of the lap 13 is absolutely three laps to go. But two laps to go on lap number 14. So we just got to be having for our last two more to go. And before at the end of the trial season, surviving 15 laps in a slower thing as well. 
and because this is absolutely inside of New Hampshire Speedway and about to do like this one not this one because in New Hampshire Speedway or the raceway as well we probably be making for about for the fastest lap so I'm gonna be going all the way around this one and this is the absolutely that the white flag has been dropped off for the lap 15 now it should be going to be your head right back into the pits and before we're going to be seeing the results and for our this time as well so the last couple of laps we're just going to be making for a contain like this thing and because it's still overcast for just a pretty long day and in the, because of the as well so even like i say it's taking for over 40 seconds off for this course now like i say we have absolutely the checkered flag we got the win and because looks like this is absolutely for to do like this we got our a very chance for congratulations not on to me for as well and because of qualifying is not going to be very awkward this off the 10 for just going to be going around here now it's taken back into the pits and i'm going to be bringing the number 26 back home and looks like let's bring the number 26 back home and it's just already to do like this one and probably the lap times doesn't count into the pits now let's just gonna be seeing around inside of the lap times totally even for it's over 30 seconds about the lap times as well so as you can see about with this thing is 32 seconds but where is the fastest lap time will be 32.079 I cannot believe that we're absolutely having for the 15 laps longer as well and that is the end of the video. So if you like for today's video don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and click that bell if you don't like for the slowest race that contains for just uh, and allegedly cringe as well probably. Thanks for watching and for all your support and this game is gonna be linked in the description down below and this should be Turbo Concept is signing off as well, for just gonna be doing for about like this one, and I'm gonna be talking to you, parfait viewers and mini lads, and fans around here all later.